Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you all the puzzles that I'm taking to the November puzzle swap um, with the Toronto puzzle swap. So if you're in Toronto and you're a puzzler, then maybe it's something you wanna join. Just look it up on Facebook. Um, the group started as just like people who like puzzles coming together. So once their puzzle was done, they could trade it. Um, instead of just like hoarding all these puzzles, which is great. But now, because it has become so popular and people are coming from all parts of the city, um, it's really hard to just like put one puzzle up and be like, hey, anybody want to trade? And then you have to like spend it now or getting to your trading location or whatever. So every few months they host like a big group swap where you can post your things online, plan to meet people there for your swaps, just show up with all your puzzles and see what else other people have they want to trade away. It's really cool. So I'm showing you what I'm taking this time. If you want to see last time's puzzle swap, I'll link that. Also the time before that, which was the first one, this is the third one they've had this year and the third group swap in total. So let's go. So, whoa, sorry guys. This is the first one. Um, it is a box set of puzzles. There's 10 puzzles. There's 10 puzzles in here, I was right. Um, they have all been done and a couple are missing. So this one is not there, uh, which is the Great Wall of China and also the Neuschenstein castle. Neuschenstein? Neuschenstein? I don't know how to say it. It's in Germany, I think. Anyways, that castle is also not in here, but everything else is. So I'm taking this giant box set to trade. Um, What else? I have a giant bag here. Okay, so uh, first one, or I guess second, whatever. I have this one here that I'm going to bring. It's a Panorama by Mega Puzzles. Apparently this time I did a lot of Mega Puzzles puzzles. There's this one, it's a Panorama, 750 pieces. Um, then I have this spring box called the American Fire Station, which is beautiful. I love this puzzle. Um, it's 500 pieces. So I'm bringing that one too. Um, I'm also bringing this one called Animal Magnetism, which I really like. It's by the Great American Puzzle Factory, which actually I've never heard of that brand before. Um, here's another spring box. This is um, So Sweet, which is like a sewing one. This one is called Space Selfie. Um, I'm trading this back. I'm giving it back to the person that I got it from last trade, if that makes sense. So it's not like trading it away, I'm just returning it to its owner. Um, and then I have this mini mouse scrapbook puzzle, also by Mega Puzzles. All right, so then I have this one, which is called Black Labrador Retriever. Um, it's from the Paw Palettes collection by Mega Puzzles. Uh, I love this one. Like, I, it's so beautiful. It's one of those puzzles, like, very rarely do I come across one where I'm like, hey, that could be glued and hung up and it would look beautiful. That's one of those puzzles. All right, then I have this little guy. It's from Puzzle Bug. It's a little 500 ice cream. Remember when I had this bag packed nicely? And not packed nicely, and I'm all. All right, um, this is the Yoga Dogs puzzle by Eurographics. This one's been floating around the puzzle swap for a while. Um, guys, I was really excited to do it, but also it was super boring. I hated it. it you know what? It wasn't boring. It was just like, it was made me really uncomfortable after a while looking at these dogs in these weird positions. And I'd be like, I feel like this is not... I just don't like it. I don't know. Anyways, can't be happy enough to get rid of that one. So I have this uh, 275 piece squirrel. It's called the gray squirrel. It's really cute. And actually surprisingly hard for a 200 piece puzzle because all the pine cones, or pine, pine cones, all the pine needles look exactly the same. Like, I mean, it's just snow and pine needles, right? All right, and then the last one is also a box. <coughs> Pardon me. This is um, by the brand Art Gallery, which like makes puzzles based off of art also. I just got my mini controversy bell in the mail, so I don't buy my swatches. Um, so this originally came with five. When I bought it, these three and this one were all brand new. This one was used. I bought it secondhand like 
value village or whatever um and i built this one first because my daughter wanted me to because i got horses she loves horses and it was insane it was missing 14 pieces for a 500 piece puzzle that's a lot of pieces i've never had that many pieces missing ever in any amount of any puzzle with any amount of pieces so that was a lot um so it's obviously not in here anymore 14 pieces missing it's not worth it for anyone to do it again uh, but these three are still unopened i just decided i didn't really like the images i did do this one um so it's also in here but it's opened these three are new this one is gone so that's it that's what i'm taking with me today so we'll see what i get back later with i also just realized that I'm going from the swap to my mom's so I'm literally just gonna have to carry all of these puzzles for like an hour and a half out of my way.